Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines. I am the Alchemical Rabbit. And I am a Tolly. And a Tolly. Yes. Last time, we learned about a mission to deal with a parking garage. We did. Are we going to do that? No. Then what are we doing? We are going to see LaCroix. Oh, is this how we get to LaCroix? I don't know, but I'm going to eat this person. Oh, okay. That was quite rude. I mean, thankfully, you don't really need that much to top. You're topped. <laughs> I think he might be a... He's just a dude. Okay, because his face in the, like, when they showed me circling him a little bit. Yes. Or whatever, it made his eyes look red, and I was like, is he Sabat? Oh, my God. Did you did you just eat a Sabat operative? Maybe. I this don't know. This is his building. Yeah, I was going to say. We I... look up. Do, 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 do. There it is. Ah, the red one, yes. Yes, it's across the street. Sorry. From I associate, the gargoyles. I associate the gargoyles. What are you? They're hazmat. I know, but why are you here? Oh, if only you paid attention to the news. Continuing in. I don't remember anything about the hazmat guys. I don't know if we've actually seen anything about why they're here We yet. might have. I don't know now. Oh, you know, okay, I wanted to... Welcome to the corporate headquarters of the beverage empire, LaCroix. This, Hello. this building was built upon the backs of a million slightly flavored beverages. Yeah, yeah. Snack cake? What are you doing here? I mean, I gotta admit, I'm a little flattered if you're stalking me, but... Because you uh, seduced him. Anyhow, uh, you see where your little security muffin what? ended up? What? When did I seduce him? Didn't you talk to him outside of uh, the um, art gallery? Is this the same guy? Yeah, it's the fat guard from outside the art gallery. That you seduced. Oh! Ah, Jelly Donut, allow me to climb the tower. Uh, I'd love to, love but, yeah, but according to Building Trust Security me. Protocol 916, I'm going to have to verify you're supposed to be here before I can open the elevator. I hate to be a Louis Law, but I'm new here, and uh, you don't get a second chance like this every day. So what do you Louis, say? Louis, the name I seek is LaCroix. Would that be Sebastian LaCroix of the LaCroix Foundation or Dwayne LaCroix of Insurrection Baby Formula Company? Sebastian LaCroix. Uh, okay then. Mr. LaCroix, he told me to expect someone fitting your description sometime tonight. You go right on up. May the fats of many creatures fill your belly. Yeah, uh, you have a good power meeting or uh, whatever it is you types do up there. You need any security? Well, you just ring the front desk and ask for Officer Chunk. That's me, in case you were wondering. Thank you, Officer Chunk. What are you a chunk of? There is a bigger piece? Well, that seems mean. I will stitch your name in my brain. Farewell. This was not exactly a kind era in video games. We were not very nice to people. No. No, we weren't. No. Okay, so back to the thing that I was about to say before we walked in here and yes. we talked to him. Okay, in the loading screen, as we were loading up the game, getting ready to record, uh -huh. it was talking about Nosferatu and how they couldn't, like, they had to travel secretly, blah, blah, blah. Mm -hmm. And I know in the new game, they're also m making Similar. a point of that. I'm like, modernly, though, could uh, Nosferatu not get away with the just weirdos that are out there in the world as well, just... That was rude and kind of ableist. I more meant like, sorry, I did not mean it that way. I just more meant that. We do seem like we have a society where Nosferatu could basically walk around and if somebody yeah, was like, what the hell happened to you? They could just say they have like a elephantitis disease or, or something. Yeah, like, or just it was an accident. They can make up but, gruesome stories. By like, the way, if you have elephantitis, do. you're not a weirdo. You're not a weirdo. No. I totally may have called you one, but she's a bitch. So. Okay, I am a bitch and I apologize. That was really not how I meant it. Mm -hmm. Um. I'm just saying, you I know, feel like you they know, could exist. You know, we just lost the elephantitis demographic. <sighs> I know, I'm sorry. Yes. There's so many ways to get up to this elevator. It's amazing. And all of them lead you to the same place. It's almost like it's decent level design. Indeed. Oh, oh wow, they made that a lot quicker in the modded version. I... I appreciate I'm like that. I'm feet <laughs> from the door, dang. Yeah, thank, thank that... you, actually, game. That was quite good. I actually like how fast that is now. There used to be a full loading thing. This is a very ostentatious. Okay, can we office. talk about the painting above his fireplace? Just the no, 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 the one oh, tiny, the, the tiny ass painting? painting. Okay. 
that's that's a bro sitting on his like but couch. why why do you have this tiny painting above your fireplace i don't know LaCroix? is that a person right there like is that like a demon coming around to like, oh i think it's someone reaching from under the bed yeah like at the the lady oh gosh that's so much more creepy now excellent let's see these i mean to be fair i think m most the, of these well those are the those are the paintings of cain and abel yeah that, that you're right what's on the other wall be like those Let's see. That one. I've seen that one before. Yeah, I've seen those two paintings, but I think they're just French, and he's French, so I think that's all that is. And that's the other. And I think those are those more are depictions the... of Cain and Abel. Yeah, that is. So he has a bit of an he's... obsession. He really does. It's a very shiny. Tray. Light. Yeah. So you got that at the races. Oh. Is there an invisible? Wow, wall? you have like really. No, there's not. Okay. Um, I just didn't want to get too close. I love, I love that. I want that. that. Le the the Camarilla like letter <sighs> opener. Yes, it's beautiful. That's a fucking dagger. Mm -hmm. Um, don't talk to him yet. Look how tall hit the arms of his chairs. He's like, he is an infant in that seat. I mean, listen, Lacroix is sensitive. <laughs> I would, I would maybe not talk about this right now. <laughs> also compared to him. Compared he's... to the sheriff, everyone's short. Can I talk to the sheriff? No, no, the sheriff doesn't speak. What is he again? He like what? Which uh, I don't clan? think we know. Oh really? Oh, okay, I, I will take that back. I do not believe he is one of the core ones. I think there's a piece of like fiction or somebody mentioned something that he is like from Africa. Oh, okay. Like Lacroix found him. Like okay, so I think we'll get Lacroix's backstory a little bit later. Uh huh. But I think Lacroix met the sheriff like in the 19th century, like. On or during World War One or something. Okay. And like brought him back. Okay. Like and they that's, bonded and that's, like that's my understanding. Yes. Huh. You lucked out, man. There you are. I was informed of your presence in the building. Since you're here, I'll take the liberty of assuming you've destroyed the warehouse. This is correct. Yes. Boom. Most excellent. I had no doubt you'd prove my decision a prudent one. I trust you encountered no impediments to your progress on account of my personnel. Bloody Mercury, Two Faces, Dinner Assassins, Wolf People. There were no explosives on Mercury, but I found some. So the first one is you could try and blame Mercury for something. That's the second option. You know, like, I, well, Mercury didn't have any explosives, but despite that, I still. Yeah, off I don't want to do number two. The first I... one, I think, is you literally just telling him everything that happened. I think I'm just going to tell him everything that happened because I don't want to blame Mercury. Yeah, I think you're just saying I met Mercury and then there was the woman with the two faces and then I some people tried to kill me in a diner and then... I met a werewolf. Yeah. Yes, yes, I'm sure it was quite an experience. You've done well. So <laughs> I like how he just ignored all of it. That's the response to the Malkavian. I admit, not many in your position would have overcome such a trial. But don't misunderstand me. It was no fool's errand. You may yet prove to be a genuine asset. Genuine. It's a bit disturbing the lack of talent within this organization as of late. Tell me, what would you say to doing a bit of reconnaissance for me? What shall I spy with my little eyes? When you say jump, I say, where's the cliff? <laughs> Dangle something in front of me. Um. So the third one's asking for money. Do you think he'd give it to me? It's up to you. This is your story, totally. Oh, I think I'm going to just ask. I'm I'm swimming in cash, and I have not felt a need to, to get more, so I'm going to do number one. Whispers, okay. Rumors spreading around the Kindred community concerning the Elizabeth Dane, the cargo ship that was towed into port recently. Have you heard of it? Have you heard of it, totally? Uh, yeah, didn't we hear about it on either the TV or the radio? I believe so, yes. You hear them too? I mean, continue. Ignore those whispers. Tell me more. I ignored those whispers. Oh, I ignored those whispers. You have to read all the words. I ignored those whispers. Uh, well, no, I didn't. So you hear them too. I mean, continue. Okay. The police are investigating the Dane as we speak. Even the Nosferatu have little information on what's been found. However, the reason the ship has caused such speculation is because it was transporting an object called the Ankaran Sarcophagus. Says now, the GM. I'm not one to predicate yes. a decision based on conjecture. So what I need is fact. And more importantly, I need evidence that the occurrences on the Dane were not supernatural in nature and in no way relate to this 
on Corin's sarcophagus. Hmm, help me understand. You have three objectives. One, I want you to examine the sarcophagus for anything unusual. You may sense something peculiar about the sarcophagus. In fact, many kindred in the city have reported an uneasiness in the air since the Dane's arrival. Dun dun dun! Under any circumstances, open the Ancoran sarcophagus. Secondly, the police have begun their investigation. Find out what they have concluded thus far. Thirdly, take the cargo manifest for the ship. I want to find out what else it was carrying. The last thing we want is police aware of our existence. So be careful what you do in front of them. And unlike the warehouse, you cannot wholesale slaughter a ship full of lawmen without consequences. Is this understood? So don't kill anyone. More than you know. Good. Oh, and it has come to my attention that you had an encounter with Nines Rodriguez earlier. The man so does love to throw that cretinous charm of his brashly about. What exactly did Mr. Rodriguez say? He wants me to find the last round in this field of massive rectangles. I see. <laughs> you should go humor the by the numbers rhetoric he's so desperately aching to spew. Oh, please, before the chance of fascist oppressor from that dive of theirs clog the air and choke the local kind. I love humoring. I am there. Give the Anarch community my regards. Done as good. I was going to say, you going to read your dialogue? Or? I, I, I was, I was. All, All right. right, can I, so will he give me further information uh, about anything? If you try. Give the Anarch community my regards. No. Very well, I will. He gave you all the information. What other information do you want? I Maybe I had some questions about the city or like what being a vampire like is like in the long term. Go ask your sire. You murdered him. Incorrect. The sheriff executed him. Listen, LaCroix, you told him to do it. It was your word. Therefore, making it a legal act and therefore not murder. Well, I can't talk to a dead person. I don't have those skills yet. Go talk to the Tremere. <sighs> <laughs> and then at that point, like, I feel like my character would literally stomp out of the office, turn around in the elevator, flip him off, and then go down. Oh, <laughs> thankfully, you've never had to deal with me actually GMing a game of Vampire and playing the Prince. Oh, gosh. I... I think I might murder you. Oh, you can't. Also, did we... Yes. When we came out of the elevator, were we just standing in front of the front desk? Yes. Okay, that's not how that should work. It's just the game trying to save you time. I... Well, <laughs> I feel like there's other places. So there. where are we off to now? You know what? Let's look at our log. We have many quests down. Okay, we now can investigate the Elizabeth Dane. Um, I feel like we should finish Necromantic and find fish he resides in the skyline apartments anything from santa monica by the way um i can go see back the tremere. To, and you need to report back to arthur back in santa monica and yeah you need to see this the, the tremere who is downtown yes okay okay yeah so everything is still downtown yeah other than arthur yes Oh, it was weird. He, like, blinked in because of a cigarette. Oh, you just saw it. And I just saw the cigarette at first. I was like, what the heck? What, what is this? This, I believe, is the parking garage. Oh, no. This is the way to the parking garage. Oh, I see. Hello? Yeah, see, if you go behind him, that's the garage now. See the a sign above? Yes, yeah. Parking here. Yep. $10. I mean, do you want to go in and do that part? You know what? We're here. Yeah. We might as well. All right, so we're just here to get a briefcase. Yeah. All right, shouldn't oh, be a problem. Loading screen. Out of nowhere. All right, so ladies and gentlemen, we have entered a combat level. Help us all. Oh, yeah. <laughs> all, right. all right, now keep... I am a vampire. Keep in mind you have the ability to turn invisible down here, and... Oh, oh. Well, they've already seen you. Good job. That was weird. That was. Oh, those blood splatter textures. That's going well. All right, that was a good swing and a miss. He's dead. All right, so... Hold on, I have a few here. questions. Yes. I have a few questions. Okay. Not the least of which is, when you go into combat, why aren't you using blood buff? I don't know. 
Okay. So now that they weren't seeing me. They will not know where you are. Cool. Now, remember, before you start swinging, you probably want a blood buff. Yes. That's blood heal, blood buff. Now eat him. Really? What? Okay, well, you have to be next to him. That's the first problem. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man, we're going to get lots of squares here. Oh, yeah, we are. I hope it does not break the game. He doesn't know where you are now. Off your skate doesn't... Yeah. Good job. He... Oh, you canceled it at the last moment. Did I? Yeah, you did. Oh. And then you hit, it to, you, you hit it twice. Oh, sh I think... I think that's I, part of the reason why you're failing. Is because you're hammering the button? Oh, I'm no, I'm not hammering it. I just... I slipped to that time. Ah, okay. Okay. Because okay. I was going to say, if you're hitting the button multiple times, that means you're activating and canceling. Yeah. No, no. I wasn't hitting multiple times. I was... Um... Okay. All right. Stealth mission. And keep in mind, obfuscate does not go down when you stop. Yeah, when I'm... Mm -hmm. Yeah, when I'm not moving, it doesn't go down. Exactly. Oh, oh good. That guy's separating himself. Let's go uh, eat him. All right. Wait, what are you doing? You still have obfuscate on. I know. I'm getting over here so that when it runs out... There we go. Excellent job. Excellent job. Yeah, you didn't need to do the stealth kill because we wanted the blood. Yeah, I, I and I figured I would probably be able to get him as long as, like, mm -hmm. I, I, he was actually away from Now, people. we will need Obfuscate back. Yes. Do. There we go. Get to blood buff. Yep. Yeah, you didn't even need blood buff there. No, but I... I, I do, I do I'm miss, to be better I miss about the having... non-patched um, blood buff feed combo, which is just infinite feeding. Yeah, that would be cool. Now, keep in mind, if you are full blood and health, it may be quicker to just break their necks. No, oh, yeah, that's true. I, I mean, sorry, I, I actually forget I can do that sometimes because I'm just so used to being like, oh no, I Obfuscate's should. Obfuscate's dead. Yes. Um. Of oh no, I can actually like. Oh yeah, you're used to the longer kill. Yeah. yeah if you get him from behind, you can do it when it pops the icon. Yeah. Like here. So like E. e. And see, it used the chunk of your obfuscate meter. Yeah, but but no. it's still up. Yeah. All right, we're gonna pop it again. There we go. And then the sad, pitiful mortals continue to die. Yeah, there's a whole bunch of new like. To look to your right. I want to see what enemy. That is your left. Sorry. <laughs> God. Because there's all this road over here we're ignoring, so I just want to make sure you're okay with that. Oh, I will go back there. I'm just trying to kill these guys. Oh, I know. I just more meant if there were enemies. Oh, um... Strategic thinking. Yes, you're right. Because if they can't, then they'd be... Just walk. Oh. What was... So... I bumped into it. So him. we talked about walking down this side road. No, and I... And then you proceeded to squeeze past the enemy going the other way. Because I wanted to kill these guys first, which is what I said. And then I was going to go down there. So why did you choose to squeeze past him instead of just killing him? Because I was trying to get behind him to oh. try to do a stealth kill so that I could auto-kill him and then just have to deal with the one guy. I see. How'd that work? Uh, it didn't work like I wanted to. I accidentally okay. bumped him. <laughs> I see. Can I go up this? Uh, you probably could, but it's not currently the mission. I just was curious if it actually worked or if it went anywhere. Yeah. I love how you're like just crouch walking right now. Oops, sorry. <laughs> okay, so I am good well, to now go. Now we need to go down the ramp. Yes. Yes. Because that just looped. Yeah. So there were no enemies that way, but you know, we're just we're trying to. Do you know trying... if I can. Um... Oh, that's a little unfortunate. Listen, that's what happens when you get competing graffiti. <laughs> they, they just duel? Yeah, they glitch. Well, are we adding ours with these yes. beautiful... Yes, yes we are, and that's why I don't want to be in this level longer than we have to be. <laughs> like, I am mildly concerned about the stability of the art package here. Alright, I think I should... Crouch. Crouch and obfuscate? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Alright, let's... Because right on the right has a machine gun, he's I'm the bigger gonna, threat. Yeah, I'm gonna kill him. Now remember, you'll probably bump him if you get to... Sidestep. There we go. E. Oh, he just gutted his friend! He did. Uh, oh. All right, his friends are on their way. Oh, God. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's going to be one of these fights. All right, run away. She's running very quickly in a crouched position. Oh, oh she's been it. stabbed in the back. 
She's been sliced. She's been diced. She's been julienne fried. Oh, come on. She has passed the blood heal. All right, some health is coming back. We're just running away for a second. All right, why she doesn't cast it again, no one really knows. Because I was hoping... There we go. There we go. Because I was okay. hoping I could draw one of them, which is what happened. Thankfully, it worked out. Okay. Let's try that again. Yeah, because the, the strat... Okay, okay, please get out of crouch. Thank you. All right, are they still... Okay, no, they've run yeah, away. The music's calming down. If there is, there's only one or two left alive. Yeah, no, I think you there's... you killed at least two. Three now. Oh, okay. Oh, I didn't realize I had killed Oh, the yeah, other you, were, one. you killed quite a few. Okay. Keep going. You are a vampire. I will keep telling you this. Well, I know, but I we were crouching before, so... Cause I, well, I know, to... but I'm trying to build up your confidence here. That's true. That is true. Okay. Oop. He totally saw you before you did that. He did, but now he doesn't see me. No, he doesn't. So I'm just going to let him calm down. And he runs into you. Oh, oh God. That would have been funny. <laughs> that would have been funny. Why aren't we eating him? Because I... <laughs> why, why are we not standing and eating that man? Because that would be... Oh, my God. All right, Sir! you know what? Just let him go. Just let him okay, go. Okay, he was just... He was just scared shit. You want me to be fair? Okay, he saw me, and then I immediately... Oh, God! My God. He... <laughs> what was that? That was me getting my weapon out. Why? Why? Why didn't you eat him? Oh, because he's immune. Okay. Yeah. All right. I'm going to let this other guy come My up. favorite part is the... But you swung 20 feet away from him. I know. Come over here so I can eat you. Just run around and eat him. You're a vampire. <sighs> What's... Why is he immune? Try it again. Because your die rolls suck and you aren't blood buffing. Come here. And you're not next to him. Hold on. Now right. she's running for the further one. Well, because he's further. Oh, okay. There All we right, go. Good. Now, see, he acts as a shield a little bit okay, there. Die. Oh, you're going to get shot in the back. Because, once again, if you can position it so that their body is between you and the person shooting you, yes. their body will take shots. Yeah. I think it's I, not... That was amazing. He was running away, and I actually grabbed him. You did for once. I'm quite proud of you. Yay! Um, <laughs> yeah, in the unpatched version, uh -huh. that is the ultimate, like, defense. Oh, I imagine, yeah. Because they'll just shoot him up, and worst case, they'll kill him. All right, we're good now. No, that's weird. I let's get out of Crouch, and let's keep going deeper, please. Uh, did the other guy die? Who I... knows? We'll find him later. We're here for a briefcase. Briefcase, yes. Can I actually go in any of these doors? No, no. unfortunately. Yeah, unfortunately, you've been playing Outer Worlds. How does this compare to the pinnacle of first-person RPG technology? I'm not gonna lie, it's um, it's a little janky. How dare you? Going in. Char. Why? Why do you <laughs> always swing? I don't know. Oh God, there's so many of them. Yeah. I don't know if I would have agreed on that one. <laughs> Okay, got that guy. Shit. Oh, it is. This is amazing. <laughs> good. Good. All right. At least they mostly just have bats. Yeah. Oh, my God, because you're a vampire, so they're attacking you with bats. Okay. I get it. Yes. Oh, God. Okay, All run right, away. lost blood buff. She has not used blood heal. She is not using her amazing vampiric powers to her advantage. She is positioning her body as a shield between the humans, though. Listen, so I was just her, trying to eat. She will not pause the game Damn and it. drink a blood pack. I forgot she I will could do suffer that. a final death. <laughs> Would you like me to take over? Ladies and gentlemen, we will I'm be so back sorry. next time. If you have enjoyed, please be sure to like, subscribe, and share. Until then, I have been the Alchemical Rabbit. And this has been a very dead Atoli. And we'll see you later. Bye, guys. Thanks for watching.